Jamie Lynn Kulikowski here, your Congresswoman in Colorado's 6th Congressional District starting in 2021. After reading the coroner's report for Elijah McClain, talking to some of his former co-workers and reading multiple articles about what happened when he died, I'm ready to make my official statement on his case. Elijah McClain died for freedom. He's not the first or last American to ever do this. What I learned about Elijah McClain is that he was a very original young man. He was just different. And in fact, one of the articles I read, he said this during his struggle with the police. I'm just different. I'm going to be very candid and say I blame the liberal media and the democratic establishment for his death because what they do and what they've done over the last four years is write articles and speak rhetoric about diversity and inclusion and how we're all ready for diversity and inclusion and we're all ready to unite and come together with all of our differences. And what they really mean is that now people can look different and, and they can come in the group, but you still can't act different, speak different, believe different, or you will get, you will get killed physically, financially, socially, any way that they can kill you, they'll do it. And Elijah McClain made the ultimate sacrifice for his freedom. I made the ultimate financial sacrifice for my freedom. I lost my job in 2017 for my freedom, or I lost my job in 2018 for my freedom. And what we all need to recognize at this point in time is that the society is really not ready and so be careful with letting your heart get pulled by the Democrats because they're the, the least ready you know I started fighting Trump in 2017 and if all liberal Democrats had started fighting him at the beginning of his term you'd all realize now he's not the enemy. We are our own enemy. So I, I realize that I'm on the wrong side. I was a Democrat for years, a very liberal Democrat. And I, I've come over to the other side because I see that, you know, while Trump is, he's edgy, he says offensive things, he's, you know, a lot of, a lot of parts of him are, are not ready for, full diversity and inclusion, but at least he's honest about it. And, and honestly, what he's done, though, to level the playing field for women, for black people, for a lot of marginalized groups, he's done more than any president in our history. So, freedom still isn't free. There are people still paying the ultimate sacrifice. Elijah McClain's won. I paid the ultimate financial sacrifice. It was scary, but I'll never regret it. If you want to keep moving in a direction of social justice and change and freedom you need to vote Trump Pence for President and VP. Vote Jamie Lynn Kulikowski for Congress. If you want a future of fake unity, and the reality is that we're just all held captive and being controlled and regulated, then go ahead and vote Democrat. But we don't we don't want that. We've come too far. Let's keep our foundation
and move forward from here. Trump, Pence, Kulikowski.